Hey guys, what's up and welcome back. So for today's video, I have a video try on haul of the Skims apparel drop. So if you want to see what I picked up, just keep on watching. Okay, so as I'm sure a lot of us were, we've been waiting for Skims to drop like this type of stuff forever. So I was so excited whenever I saw this, I was like, I, I was like counting down the days until this launch. So the first thing that I got, this is the, the pants. It just says pant. I'm not sure. The boyfriend fleece pant, I think is what they're called. Now, let me just tell you, these things are thick. Like they are, they're not like a thin fleece. Like it says fleece, but it's like not fleece, if that makes sense. This is the inside material. It's like a, it's soft, but it's like a, a rougher soft. It's not like a, um, you know what I mean? It's not like thick, like terry, but it's also, it's like a mix of terry and fleece. That's what it feels like. So it's soft, but like these things are massive. I got these in a small because like my hips, I'm, I'm small, like petite frame, but my hips stick out further. So a lot of times if I'm wearing like a lower rise pant, it'll kind of sometimes give me like those hip indentions. Uh, and if I wanted to roll them down, I wanted it to be like really loose so that I could just roll and like just let it be super baggy. So this is a size small. And initially when I put these on, I was like, I wasn't really feeling it. But then the more that I had them on, these things are big. I'm right at 5'3", like right at 5'3". And these things are so long. I love long sweatpants. So that doesn't really bother me. But with how... Like, it's not just, it doesn't go down into like a boot cut. This is like just a wide leg pant all the way down. But the best part is they do have pockets. Thank gosh, because a lot of my Skims pants don't have pockets. And I'm always dropping my phone in my pocket. I'm such a pocket person. So I'm always dropping my phone in my pocket. I've always got my lip gloss in my pocket or my wallet in my pocket or something because I don't like carrying bags. So, and then even around the house, but these things are, if you can see, they're really big. So this is a size small. I don't regret getting a size small, but I probably could have gone up to a medium just as far as like the waist goes, because this isn't as loose in the waist as I would have liked it to be. Like, cause I can wear from Walmart. I can wear like a men's large. They're like cheap sweatpants are like $9. I can wear those in a large and even an extra large and just roll them down and they look really cute and slouchy. So these are small and I like the fit, but if I did rebuy them, I would probably order a medium just so they could be even bigger. So I know that might be kind of wild because y'all are going to see in the trial and these things are, they swallow me. So with that, I got the hoodie. I think that I'm sending this back and the sole reason is because it's too tight on my neck. I got an extra small because the pants, I don't care if they're super oversized, but the hoodie... I'm not a hoodie person already, so if it's like way too big, I'm not going to want to wear it. But this, something about the, the neckline on this is so tight. Like, I, there's no room for me to like, like go like this and pull it forward. It's so thin, I could barely get my head through the top of it. So while the hoodie is like, my husband asked if he could keep it. And I was like, babe, this isn't going to fit you. Like, it's not going to like, body wise, yes. Because this is an extra small. And you see how big this is? Like... It's, she's big, but the neckline, like, I don't know if you're going to be able to tell. That's it. It doesn't stretch either. Like, that's the neckline. So whenever I was trying to pull my head through it and then, like, pull it down so it didn't feel so claustrophobic, it was not working. And so I think this looks so cute with the pants and it would look so cute with, like, some leggings or biker shorts. But it's the neck that has me so conflicted because... I just know that I won't ever reach for it because I already deal with being claustrophobic and like having something constantly tugging at my neck is just not, not going to fly with me real well. So unfortunately, I think that I am sending this back, but it's not because I don't like the hoodie. It's strictly because of the neck, but this is the same inside as the pants and it's really thick. Like if it's cold, that hoodie is going to keep you warm. Like it's thick. I don't know how many times I can say thick. Anyways. Okay. And then I got the biker shorts in bubble gum in a size extra small. 
And these, I think, I keep going back and forth on these. I think these are so cute, but I also feel like they're not very flattering on me. Y'all are going to have to tell me in the comments what you think. I can kind of hike them up like I do my Lulu, um, my Lulu shorts. But something about this like thicker cotton material, I feel like it flattens my butt. Whereas like my Lulu ones like kind of help it a little bit. So I don't know. I think that these are so cute though. I tried these on with this shirt actually and sent a picture to my friend. I think they're super cute and they're all sold out. So like I don't want to send them back. Anyways, so there's those. I got these in an extra small. They are really soft and these do have a good amount of stretch. The band is a little tight if you do size down. Like normally I get an extra extra small, but since I've been trying to put on weight, I go ahead and get an extra small to try. So to make sure it's not so tight and this is pretty decent. I probably could do a small in the band, but this isn't tight enough to where it's going to bother me. But if you do struggle with things feeling a little bit tighter, I would size up in this type of style just because this part is a little bit more fitted and it's a lot more stretchy. Whereas this band part is, is not, it doesn't have as much stretch. So then I did get the matching t-shirt to go with these. This is the vintage cheat t-shirt bubble gum size, extra small. This to me, they're calling it the, she's calling it the vintage tee, but this to me feels just like the t-shirts she released when she first ever released her outdoor collection in summer 2021. This feels like that, like that material. It's that thinner kind of, I don't want to say rough because I feel like that's not, but I don't like this as much as the cotton jersey because something about, okay, you look at this t-shirt and it has no form to it like most of her shirts do like look at this you see how the cotton jersey has like this formation in it and it's shorter okay well I have a short torso so I love those because the arms are like a good short length and because it's a shorter arm it doesn't dig up under my armpits I'm super particular with this stuff um and it, it like sits right at the top of my pants or I can pull it up if I want like, you know, it to look a little bit like crop cute. And it's very fitted and like gives you like the hourglass appearance. This is cute, but there's no form and the sleeves are a little bit longer. And it, because it's longer, it's tighter up under my arm. And I don't like that. So the, short, the shirt is adorable. I just don't like the fit and style as much as I do the cotton jersey shirts. So I really hope that I can at some point get the cotton jersey t-shirt in bubblegum so that I can have this color in the actual style that I like. But I don't know. I haven't had any luck with these vintage t-shirts. I did a video on these almost a year ago the first time she released them and that was a hot mess. So I don't know if I just don't get on with this longer material because my torso is so small or if it's just the material and fit in general. I don't know, but y'all let me know in the comments what you think whenever you see the try on. Okay, and this makes me really sad because I had a whole outfit planned. I'm gonna probably insert here. I'm waiting on one more item from this collection that I ended up ordering separately because I didn't know I wanted it until I actually looked at it and saw Skims posted on one of their models and then I went back. There's only one size left and it was an extra, extra small. So I'm hoping it fits. Okay, so here is the outfit. It has a zipper, so I can't zip it up by myself, I don't think. I might can try, but there's the neckline, the arms. It kind of looks, it's just like my uh, uh, raw hem, what, what was it? The onesie that I just got, and I love that it's like got this part, and then it comes down into pants. I got, an extra extra small because it's all that was left and this actually might work. It looks pretty, pretty long and I'm not that tall. So let's try it on. It's been a long day. So if you can hear my kids in the background, I'm sorry. So this is what this looks like. I think that it is really cute and you can see how it, like I don't have it zipped. I've got it hooked at the top because it has, I'd have to figure out what panties to wear with this, but it's hooked at the top because nobody's here to help me zip it. So I'm just having to work with what I got, but this is what this looks like. And I think that it is so cute. I love this color and I like it just like I like the, uh, the 
oh my gosh, the raw him, raw edge, whatever the heck it's called, that collection. But I think that this will be really cute with my foam runners. And yeah, I'm slightly obsessed with this. This is so cute. I did get this in an extra, extra small because it was all that was left. And I think it fits really, really nicely. So like I said, I'm short, so it works, but yeah. But I'm probably inserting a clip right here of me trying it on. It's just not here yet. It's supposed to be here tonight. So I'm gonna be editing this video with that. So it will be here and I'll be able to show you. Um, but with that being said, I bought this product right here to go with said outfit and it doesn't look cute on me and I'm really sad. I knew I took a chance with this because I'm not a hat person. I used to wear hats backwards as a teenager or like I'd get a Vans hat, like a neon Vans hat and wear it to like warp tour, but I'd like leave the, the bill like flipped up. So it just looked kind of like cute. But this, I had a whole outfit planned in my mind. This with the outfit that you're gonna have seen and then my foam runners with my Skims bone socks. I just feel like that would have looked so cute but the problem with this is because i have such a small head and my ears are so small when i put this on i look like i'm wearing my dad's work hat like it i can tighten it like i guess it doesn't look that bad but i feel like the bill is too big and it doesn't look as cute as like i thought it would with the outfit that i had in mind like i feel like this would not go with that outfit at all it was just the colors were pulling but i was telling my husband i was like it's it's covering my ears and he was like pull the tops of your ears out and i said i can't they're too small and when i pulled the tops of my ears out they were like sticking out like this because my ears are so small he started laughing and i was like see i can't do it so i don't know it's kind of cute like if you want to like kind of hide yourself like it's not horrible but it's also not like I'm vibing with it. You know what I mean? Like, you know, when you put those things on and you're just like, oh, okay, shoot, I look cute. Like, I put this on and I'm kind of like, okay, I mean, like, it's whatever, but I don't feel as cute and confident in this hat as I thought I would. But I still think it's a cute little moment. I wish the bill wasn't as big, but once again, I've got a small head. So, but what I do like is on the back here, it says skims. I thought that that was a cute little, it's like rubber and it says skims. So you can adjust it and stuff here, which is great. So, but yeah, this is the inside. So it's just a basic cap. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. I really like it. I just wish it fit my head better. But I don't know, once again, I'm everybody's their, their own worst critic and my friends were telling me that everything looked cute on me. So I don't know, y'all let me know in the comments. But with that being said, that is everything that I picked up from the apparel shop. What, what did you guys pick up? I know I had some people messaging me on Instagram asking me, sorry, I'm trying to put this back in the bag asking me if I was ordering anything and what I was ordering. And um, so I love when you guys come and ask me because I feel like it's just fun to talk about. I cannot get this back in the bag. I had it in there perfectly. Okay, I'll pull with that later. But anyways, this morning was the, as I'm fil filming this, this morning was her huge Valentine's Day drop and I ordered so much from that drop. So y'all subscribe and click your notification bell because the second all that stuff comes in, I will be doing a video and a try on on all of it. I'm so excited. I love her Valent Valentine's Day drops. I started getting into skims right at the end of 2020, right before she did like her first big Valentine's Day launch in 2021. And I didn't realize how popular her stuff was at the time. So I was only able to snag a couple things. But like every time I see them, it takes me back to that time when I was first really getting into skims. And so there's something special about like the Valentine's Day launches that just get me really excited. So yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment down below. Let's talk. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out. And if you liked it, if you didn't, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. Either way, it helps me out. And yeah don't forget to go follow me on my socials i will have all this stuff linked down below i don't know what's sold out what's not sold out but i'll have my sizes and everything down below so if she does a restock or if you want to buy it from someone off a resale site so yeah anyways <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching i hope you'll have a great rest of your day or night wherever you are and i will talk to you on my next one bye guys Mwah.